today I will be teaching you how to degas solvent by bubbling nitrogen through it. So what you're going to need is you're going to need a flask, uh, the solvent of your choice, in this case we're using ethanol, and a septa to go on top. Uh, bubbling nitrogen through a solvent is a good method of degassing if, you have, if you're planning to use that solvent for a fairly insensitive uh, reaction. Um, it's not quite as thorough at degassing as, say, freeze pump thaw is. Um, but it is definitely good, a, a good quick and dirty way to get uh, the majority of the volatiles out. So we have an oven dried needle here and it's hooked up to our Schlenk line. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to turn on the nitrogen bubbler. So as you can see by the bubbles at the back, the nitrogen is currently flowing through. You don't need an incredibly high um, flow rate of nitrogen, you just need to see a couple bubbles. And so we're gonna open up the tap to nitrogen. So the nitrogen is flowing in through this tubing here to the back, which means that when I open up my tap, I want the tap to line up to the back part of the Schlenk line. So in that case, it's this way for me. So now we have nitrogen flowing out through this tubing out this needle. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the needle into my solution. So you wanna make sure that the needle goes all the way into your solution. Now right now this is still a closed system so you're actually not going to get any bubbling. So the next thing you're going to do is that you're going to get a, like something like a disposable needle. And you're just going to puncture another hole in and leave that needle in there. So as you can see once the needle is inserted there are bubbles in my solution. And that means that the nitrogen is coming in and will be replacing the oxygen which will be leaving by this uh, opening at the top we generated with the needle. So you should, you should degas your solvent for about 20 or 30 minutes before it's ready to use. And then once it's ready to use, all you're gonna do is just remove this needle first. So now it's back to a closed system. You're gonna remove your needle. And now you have your degas solution.